Morning, y'all. Welcome to the Style Chronicles. We have one piece of furniture. Yay! Um, a new little side table that we bought to go in between two chairs we're putting right there. Right, Abel? Yeah. And son still has pajamas on. They're his last year's Christmas pajamas, and they're a little too short in the belly for him. But it's okay. We're working on getting new pajamas, right? You're supposed to be dressed because we're trying to leave. Yes, Alvin moved. He was in that window yesterday. Now he's over there. Crazy. And it is so foggy today. I could not see in front of me when I was taking Eva to school. I couldn't see the car in front of me. And I couldn't see cars that were coming our direction. It was crazy. I'm like, whoa. And this fog still has not lifted. You can see tractor out there. But the fog is still very, very much there. So we'll see how our... Drive is. Um, I drive roughly about 45 minutes across Houston to get to my office. So, okay, calm down, buddy. Um, just getting everything together, right, Harper? There's brother's shoes, there's his jacket, there's his backpack. Here is, no, oh, no, no, no. Pick that up, what you just threw up there, and put it in the sink and in the trash can. That is not how you get rid of the trash. Take this, and where does this go? Where does this go? Don't do that again, you know better. You have way better manners than that. Go put it in the trash can. Mommy is not your maid. Thank you. Okay, so now that we have that out of the way, um, I've got, let's see, breakfast, this is my lunch, this and this, my, milk my protein. Shake my milk yes, that's shake. your milk. Um, the kids like these for breakfast and Eva likes them for snack. This is Abel's lunch right here. I make it when I make Eva's lunch um, and his snack. And then a change of clothes for Harper. Abel's clothes that he's supposed to be wearing and then the scarf that I'm going to wear today. And that's it, right? My bag. And let's see if you can see. I tried to pattern mix a little bit this morning. So I'm wearing the red J. Crew, red and black J. Crew vest and then a striped shirt. Black jeans, which are dirty already, because someone put their dirty feet on me. Um, black boots, and then, like I said, that scarf that's going to color match a little. I need to get a blanket for you. You don't have a blanket. We've got all these stickers. You see all the stickers they put on the baby carrier? It looks so sad. It looks pathetic. And then this, because I wash this thing so much. Like, literally, I'm washing these weekly because they get dirty. Or her diaper explodes, and so this gets dirty. This, though, has been through so many washes that all the stuff is, like, peeling off. Um, it just looks bad. This, this carrier has had it. It's been through all three of my children now. Um, so it's definitely on its last leg, which is probably a good thing because we didn't have to buy a new one with every single child, which we knew when we started having babies that we wanted more than just one. So I made sure everything was gender neutral and we would not have to purchase it three or four times. Uh, according to child. So yes, all of our baby stuff has seen better days, but has also made, made it through some journeys, um, which I think is very smart because it's cost efficient. And um, yeah, the products, you know, that we bought were, like I said, gender neutral. So here you go, I found you a blanket. I found you a blanket. Here we go. So you won't be cold. Okay, so now we're gonna get Booger Bear dressed right there. You need to put these on, buddy, in this shirt. Okay, so we can go to the car and leave. H-E-B, because we have a fridge again. So now we need to get stuff to put in it, right? What are you doing? Where's your hand supposed to be? Hand on the basket. Hand on the basket. Oh. <laughs> How are y'all? Who, Eva? Yeah. No. We're at H-E-B, right? What do you want to get? No, what do you want to get? Yeah. Daddy's calling. Gotta love H-E-B for their buddy book machine. I think my kids think they're gambling or something. Because <laughs> they love this machine. I'm Miss Eva over there reading. Awesome, one point. 
Alrighty, let's go. Come on, sissy. You left your stickers. Do you want your stickers? They're right there. Come on. Bless you. God bless you. Yeah, we're gonna go to the Y. But I gotta. If I had known that uh, the floor guy wasn't gonna come right away, I would have gone to the Y and then come to the store. But he said he was gonna be home at 5:30, so we came here first. But now I have to go home because we bought ice cream. I need to clean this. There are real poinsettias, yes. But you know why we didn't buy real ones? Because Cracker Jack, they're poisonous to dogs. They're poisonous. Okay, hands on the cart. They're poisonous? Hands on the cart. What are your hands? They're poisonous for dogs? Yes, if dogs eat the flowers, they're poisonous. Hands on the cart. Good job. Harper, put your hands on the cart. Harper, put your hands on the cart, Harper. Hands on the cart. <laughs> hands on the cart. You cannot see. Not. You guys see your cousins every single day at the Y, and y'all still have to run and hug each other like y'all have never seen each other before. Woo, come on, let's go. Let's go. Okay, it was not done on purpose. I just saw him. He was jumping up and down just like you were. You were like... I know. He didn't punch you on purpose. No, no, no. Behave. Wait, I gotta get keys. Where are the keys? Where are the keys? Oh no, where are the keys? Uh-uh, Abel, get over here. I've already had this conversation with you about walking out into the drive. Okay. Hey, hey, guys. Uh, we are around the car. Yeah. What is my number one rule? Not to walk, walk around the car. A car. <laughs> Never walk behind a car. What did I do this to again? Sorry. No, I should probably shouldn't have walked. Sorry. Sort of. Severe. Huh. Huh. Let's go. We're 